Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Frederick, you know me as Kianomi, and we are back in Le Mans, France. And in this episode we will be buying out our competitor Don Lorenzo. We will, he will no longer be allowed to compete. We will also connect Paris and Le Mans. So with Le Mans we have right here, and we have Paris right here. So should be a fairly simple little route here. We already have the majority of the route planned out. We will drag this guy through here and up to Paris. But before we do that, we need to get rid of this guy. So let us start with some upgrades. And I think we probably want to look at... I'm not sure what we want here. Reliability could be good. Reduces purchase price. That's like a no-brainer. Uh, number 701 De Glen is a good one. G5 is a good one. That's a lot of... I didn't know I was sitting on this much innovation points. Uh, I wish I knew that. <laughs> Let's get some consumption for sand as well. And that's more or less all that we can do here. Uh, so if we want to buy him, I think we need to do it this way. So, Mr. Don Lorenzo, what is your net value? 3 million. We can do that in not too long time. What else can we actually do here? So, I think we have connected more or less everything. Do any of you need this stuff that's at 74,000 people? So, you might need it. Yes, you do. In that case, I am going to set up a signaling station right here. And we're gonna bring these guys onto here somehow. I think I built this a little bit wonky last time, so I started the the route a little bit too far up here. I should have started down here somewhere, and that makes it hard for us to connect those two. Uh, it looks like they are actually fighting a little bit on these now. Interesting. You won't stand a chance, but you're welcome to try. So that guy, incoming, incoming. I just want to make sure that everyone has a supply tower. Uh, we do want to have one here as well. Because if we don't have supply towers in both ends, the risk is that they are more likely to fill up with supplies when they're leaving than when they are entering. And that's not something that we need. We do not want to have that happening. So let's bring you into here. Uh, with... We want to go with G5 now then maybe, that's a fairly decent freight train. I think that's good, let's go with that. And I probably want to look at what Le Mans actually looks like, so we're up to 71% there. And there isn't much else that we can do, I think everything else is connected. We might be able to connect that if we're lucky. Oh no, did we not? Okay, then you... Why are you so quick? <laughs> uh, you are kind of useless, so we want to get rid of this guy. I wonder what's happened there. Was that actually built before? I'm not sure. Anyways, uh, we want to get rid of him. Somehow. Uh, do we watch, just want to delete him? Do we have oil anywhere remotely close to here? This stuff? No, there's like nothing around here that is even remotely close to being useful when it comes to that. So let's buy this guy. And let's get rid of it so that we can sell it off. We're gonna spend a bit of money here, but I think that's fine. So can you stop? I'm gonna purchase you anyway, idiot. If he puts money on it again, I'm just gonna fucking buy him instead. Then I can get rid of it, at least. Okay. Uh, so let's get some bonds in here. And let's get this guy out of the picture. The passage is clear. 
And we can liquidate everything. And then we can also get rid of this guy. Very good. So let's do some tailors here. Probably want to build a new lodge. Your normal trade station, actually. So if we do you here, then we should be able to have a tailor right here somewhere. And that's a lot better. That should be a lot better. Uh, these guys should now not go as empty, I imagine. You're not actually getting enough stuff. And that's mainly because these guys are being held up. Could we move you guys over to a warehouse? Do some warehouse gameplay today. So if we tell you to hold some fabrics. And then all of the trains that goes here will instead go to this guy. And we copy that and we paste it over to all of these. That should get Le Mans growing a little bit better here. Uh, we could even do this if we wanted to. And that could bring some of this grain into there as well. A little bit easier. That should be good. So if we need to, we can easily put grain on this one as well and do it that way. But for now, I think we need to connect these. So let's go train station in Paris. Let's go train station in... Are we bringing any... I think we're gonna use this guy to bring the rest of... The mo most of this. Because we don't have grain anywhere close to here. So we're gonna have to go over here. So many valleys here, right? I'm surprised. Uh, let's get up to there and then these guys will just hang around here somewhere. Enough space that we can have a full train, yes. And then you guys are more or less just going straight. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's that task complete. We are just flying through the tasks here. Okay, so that means that we can get rid of the grain that we are delivering from down south. So we just need... What we do this. Three and one, that's absolutely perfect. And then you will go to here. And if we need more grain, we can also bring grain from other places or to other places. But yeah, that's that's good. I like that. So we do that and then we... What do we need to do more? Gain access to the area of Burgundy and get access to the area Central Centreval de Leor. And which ones are those? That is Picardy, Nord de Pascalais, and Valeor. That's the one we need access to, as well as, I guess it's this one. Brittany? No, it was Burgundy. Burgundy, yeah. So those two we need access to 600 and 800. Your Done. Unfortunate, if not careless. Connect 10 cities. Look for other allies. Let's get rid of all of the trains that goes here. We will not need any of these. Okay, so we will bring in grain to Paris as well, where they are producing baguette. And I'm guessing baguette is done with wheat, yes. Then we will have them go in between each one of these. Probably with mixed trains. Actually running out of cash here. 
That sucks. Should be able to get that solved fairly quickly though. Probably take a look at those missions that we got as well. Because we have a few new ones now. So we need to work on those as well. Let's set up the other way as well. Two and one more. Come on. There we go. So let's take a look. Connect 10 cities to our network, secure access to six areas, connect 700,000 people to our rail network, reach a population of 100,000 in Paris. Yes, sir, will do. So we'll go from here up to Paris and go with the Glen and do probably four of them at least. We're not really at the point where we can build trains constantly without worrying about cash, but we're really close. Okay, so that is Paris being connected. Reserved. This site has been reserved for a special building, okay? Uh, are we gonna build the Eiffel Tower? Eiffel Tower? Uh, that would be interesting. Uh, do we bring wood anywhere? We... Cannot bring wood anywhere, but we can bring this stuff. So let's go for this instead. And we will probably produce oil here then. That seems to be a good option. Since we have the oil right here. This stuff. Not sure what kind of oil it is. We can take a look in a moment. So that's that stuff, and we also want wood. Do we have wood anywhere close here? I don't think so. Wood there, but the best would be to be having it here actually. So this one is 2 million, but that is gonna be worth it if we can use the same logging station that we have right there. Uh, Baker in Gion, I don't think so. A bit too far away for now. We need to connect another five cities. This is an interesting one. Tours. Maybe we should go for Tours. I think so. That would make sense. So I think I want to bid for that. Let's get you onto there. Let's try to get these guys over here somewhere. I guess we're gonna have to pay through our nose to get that done. Which is fine. I don't think we need to worry. What are you doing now? You're actually having enough stuff now, so that's good. Not getting enough of this stuff. So the one that's going to Le Mans. We need one more of you. We need one more of you. And these are actually backing up a little bit as well. So let's increase the size of you. That should help with that. Uh, this guy is probably getting quite swamped now. What does it look like? 81%. Still got some space left. Probably want to connect you actually. Since we will be using that anyway. So that's 400,000 being available here. So we can connect to you through a Can we not do that? 360,000. That is perfect. It's a crazy amount of bridge, but that's fine. We will survive. So even though we're not actually doing anything to, le to grow Le Mans, it is actually still growing. Which means that we can build another city here. And that will be... Perfumery, I think. I think that makes sense. Yeah, if we do a perfumery here. Because we have the grapes close by and we have the... 
or whatever that is, flowers, as well as those other drinks are being produced in the city down to the left. Whatever that is called, I don't remember. We have not focused on that very much in this episode, but we will take a look. So, Nantes is actually producing that from distilleries. Uh, we do need another train station here as well. Otherwise, we are going to run into issues. Great. Uh, so that allows us to have them go over there as well. And then we can bring in grain from here. The tours with you. Do two of them. What did I lose there? I'm not sure. Any a new upgrades? We have an express train and we have a freight train underneath that. So that's something that we want. It's transported mail. Uh, no thanks. I don't think so. Probably want to connect to these guys. So, burgies. I'm kind of learning to look in the details here to look if there is a tunnel or a bridge instead of looking manually every time. And I think I'm getting better at it. I feel like I'm not looking at the rails as much. Which sounds really boring in a game that is all about rails, but yeah. So be it. Uh, so the D4. Uh, it is super expensive, but it's also quite good. Is it good enough to warrant three times the price of a G5? Not so sure about that. I mean, reliability goes up as well. Consumption goes down. Yeah, maybe it is worth it. We have a lot of money now. Actually, we're shipping in between cities. We should not use that. We should use a mixed train. And that's exactly what we will do. We need to slow down time as well, because otherwise we will run over ourselves eventually. So, um, 10 cities should be no issues. Let's get one more on here. And I think, honestly, these guys can probably just have trade in between each other, more or less. Is there anyone that produces the... Yeah, you are using the cows, you're producing that stuff, and you are also producing for cows. Okay, so we will connect these two as well. And again, there is no bridge, so that's good. And I know, it's not as efficient to have it connect to the outside of a small station, because they are all kind of bundling into one row, but... I don't think it matters that much, because we're probably going to expand it really, really soon anyway. So, we should be good. We should be good. So let's set up some trains going here. And let's connect you two. Okay, so that is eight cities. We need two more. And do we have anyone that is like obvious? So we have everyone here. We have everyone in our own place. Uh, we have breakdowns right here because we don't have a repair station. We have one more city there, and we have... Wait, can we build over all, everything now? No. Okay. So we have one more city available to us right now, and then we need to actually expand. So... What did you cost? 2.09 million? That's something that we're gonna hook up to, I think. Probably want to do this first, actually. So we built this factory here to produce. So we're actually going to need a train station that goes from here. 
and probably can we have a warehouse on this side as well we sure can if we have you there can we have these guys kind of do this sort of it's not gonna be the fastest but it'll work Increasing power is always good. Increasing power is always good. So let's do that. Let's connect these to here somewhere. And you to there. We will set up these guys to go here. Again, I'm not sure the D4 is worth it, but we will try and see how many we can actually do there. So if we do three, that should be hopefully enough. And then we need those flowers here as well. I think they're flowers. I feel like we need to look into a few of these different things that we have here. So these, lavender, yeah, so it's a sort of flower. And what else was it that we said that we don't know? These ones. Those are olives. Okay, so what we are producing up here would be olive oil then. So you will do oil meal right here. And you will be producing olive oil. Gotcha. Gotcha. Do we have any trains here? No, we don't. So let's set up some trains going here. Probably are going to have to do that a little bit differently, actually. So let's set up warehouse. That would make a little bit more sense. We'll take you over to here. Yeah, that that should be fine. And then we can have all of us here. So my idea here is that I want to make sure that we are not having a bunch of trains filling up the stations and instead having them go to warehouses it doesn't impact the station as much when we are producing something like this probably want to have this guy also go there actually so let's try to do that uh, you guys can change your routes over to here instead And we will copy all of you and paste over to each and every one of these. They will still get paid, they just won't show that they're getting paid at the moment. So that should be no issue. So we're seeing a breakdown here as well. Let's get a repair station. Let's get a repair station here as well. Let's get one onto this guy. I think the rest of them do already have repair stations, you might not have. You of course are having breakdowns, like one after another. <laughs> uh, can we upgrade some tra trains maybe? Class 3B, what's that? And class 1, 2, 1. Let's take a look at what those two are. So we have class 1, 2, 1. That is our 78 kilometers an hour mixed train. That's quite good. And we have the plus 3B as well. It was right here. That's our old one. Wait, so class 1 to 1 is actually better? Come again. Track to power 106. Track to power 109. Okay, so this one is actually better. We want to use this one. Instead of the... Instead of the glance. And instead of the... Class 3Bs as well. Very well. Uh, are they more reliable? Can that be why they were not 
as good maintenance reliability 98% 95% yeah I don't know how are we doing with you are you still producing constantly yes let's see if we make it can bump up the use there uh, we still need more cities and I would like that to be these probably it's actually only one city here but that's fine we don't need more than one city there because we can still contact connect to Dion down here Still, Paris actually needs to continue growing. It does grow quite well though, so I'm not super worried. We are producing clothes as well, not really super fast. It's mainly because you are not producing enough. So let's see if we can up your production a little bit. So on the map, in our network, we have 12 people needing stuff. We can produce 12. So we should be good in that aspect. I think this means that in our networks, we need that much. And this is how much we can produce in our network. I think that's how it works. That's how I'm gonna expect it to work. So we're gonna need you and we're gonna need you. And we're gonna need to connect you guys something like this. Let's go there instead. It's just easier. I don't know, it doesn't feel like it's worth it to go with the D4 just for like 2 kilometers an hour and a little bit more. This doesn't make sense. I'm gonna go with the G5 instead. That seems to be more reasonable. So, if we wanna get this, we probably wanna do that quite shortly. So, and we do need one more of those as well. So, let's go here first. And see if we can connect Dion. So if we connect him over to probably here somehow. Something like that. Still have some tunnels that we don't really need. There. I don't care about... Yeah, I don't care about any of the earthworks. We are just looking at the bridges at the moment. This is a very far way to go. Guess we can connect to here as well. It's producing the exact same thing as the others, so I think I'll just wait. If we figure out something that we need here shortly, then we can get that up and running at that point. Uh, what do you do? Cheaper contrast construction sites, but this is for innovation points. Neither of them is very good, actually, but I don't think I want to pay for it, so that is what it is. Uh, more freight money. Yes, please. Yes, please. Several trains are waiting for activation. Let's get rid of a few of you then. And these two are going in different directions, so that's fine too. That's actually because we're running low on cows there. So, Paris, how are you doing? 63,000 people now. Still need to get wood into here. Still need more tailored clothing. You are getting more tailor, I think. We can do this. So, this guy. Prioritize that and go up to this one. But I think the. Did I say that the 101 is actually faster? I did, right? Class 101. Yeah. That's actually a better train than 
That is so weird. Okay. Not sure why that would be. Are we really not having enough of this stuff? Shouldn't you be producing like massive amounts, but we don't really bring in enough. Let's do a lot more of those and let's see if we can even do something like this. That should be fine and those are okay. You're going back with the same stuff you came with, but that's to be expected, I guess. At least you're producing now, so... That's good. Um, you are running low on that stuff as well. And Paris is no longer growing now. Partially because you don't have any... What do you need milk for? I don't care, but I'll gladly, gladly bring you milk if that's what you need. Don't need him on that section there, so we will bring him in here. So first I was going to put them in here somewhere, but then we would have more queuing here than necessary. So we will try to avoid that, and apparently they decided that they want to go go around being assholes now. So let's see if we can fix that. And we do that this way. And now I think that they should all go through here instead. Yes. That's a lot better. And we can have milk go from this place to Paris with again the G5. With two of them. That's probably enough. What else do you need? Need that cheese. If we can produce the cheese here, that would be really good. And if we have planks anywhere? I don't think we have planks anywhere. Very good. Uh, that's nine cities connected. And this is going to be our tenth. Got a station master. And hire all of you. Let's take a look at him. So, dispatching trains faster. He's already level 2. Our station master is in maintenance, so bye bye. Rather have you dispatch trains quicker. Can we buy this one now? Uh, if we do this, we should be able to. There we go. Gradually become lost in argument about the next ruler. If we, friends of the Republic, show unity, the problem will sort itself out. Okay, let's set up this here. I probably want to have a completely new train station in Paris to deal with this. Just need a little bit more money to do that. Okay, there we go. Very good. Let's try to not have a gigantic hole in the ground there. Let's try to not have a gigantic tunnel. That's not a tunnel, that's a bridge. English is super hard today, apparently. But yes, let's try to not have a bridge that we don't need. That is what we're trying to say here. So... That way and that way, and then we set up some supply towers there. Connect you, connect you, connect you. And let's bring in some wood to Paris. We are going to do that immediately with the G5. Uh, we are producing a lot of this stuff. Uh, the distillery part we could do a lot better with. Question is, do we have anywhere where we could actually produce that stuff? I guess here we could. If we had some more stuff available to us. So if we want to have that right here. 
in Orleans. Uh, we need a lot more stuff of a little bit of everything and mainly grain. Do we have grain anywhere close by? We do have grain right here, which is not actually impossible to get to. And we can get those guys to go in here. And then we bring one to go just straight back here as well. Nice. And some signals there. Let's get grain from here into Orleans. G5. I think I'm actually gonna do six of them. What else do you need? You got a lot of pigs. Need some of those. These we have here. So let's see if I disconnect you to go up here. I can have you connect there and... Are we supposed to avoid having a huge hole here? Uh, we can get rid of you. And put you here instead. Yeah, so how do we get rid of this hole? Just go down it. Yeah, I mean, 4% should be fine for a freight train. And what else do you want? That should actually cover everything. So once we get that going, we should be good. You are producing a lot. Paris is again growing. And some of that is actually because we don't get this. Do you actually produce enough? Not really, we could produce more of this. So that's 800,000 to do that. Bump you up. We have another five years to build up another 250,000 people. Uh, Paris is growing quite well. We are consistently delivering stuff to here. Still are struggling a little bit with the fancy clothes, clothes that we have here. So this guy is not really producing as much as we would maybe have liked. Um, he could up it up a little bit. And see if we can, if we produce seven instead. And then we set up this guy to go from here. From Le Mans 2, yes. And over to here. That might help a little bit. Do a few trains here and see when we are getting to a point where we can't stock up anymore. Maybe it's just one or two trains. That's definitely a possibility. Actually need some signals here, it looks like. And a supply tower. Okay, still filling up quite good here. Still filling up really good. How are we doing here? We're actually using all of that as well. So do you need even more? Yeah, you do. How does it look here? You're just up to 61 still, so you're not even remotely close to at any limit. Baker in John, no thank you. Let's get one more on there. Still seeing a lot of stuff being delivered from here. Yeah, I don't know how much you actually need. It looks like you can produce endless amounts. Which I guess is good. So Paris, are you actually missing anything else? You're still missing milk, actually. Why is that? You need to expand this one, that's for sure. Uh, we are bringing milk here, right? Yeah, we are. Maybe not very much, maybe we need... Ah, we're actually running low on milk. That's why we're having issues. Got it. Got it. 
So anything else that we need to keep an eye on here? I think the rest of all this looks quite good. How about you? Do we still have... No, no, we actually have more than what we need. So we are actually seeing some trains just standing around. Yeah, I think we're doing really well. We have another 15,000 people to go in Paris and then we are done with the Paris mission. And then we need to connect just a few more thousand people to our network. And considering how well we're growing, I don't think that should be an issue either. What do you actually need? You would like some olives, but olives is like all the way over here. So unless we have something a lot closer, I'm not going to give you olives. We do have some there, but that's still very, very far away. Here I'm thinking, sitting here thinking that, yeah, Planck's factory would probably be quite good here. And it just builds it himself. Very helpful game, thank you. Very helpful. So let's try to do this. Let's try to get you to go over here instead. And we do wood here. And again, we can increase you to maybe eight. And probably expand this station as well. Well, uh, we did reach the 100,000 that we need in Paris. And we are building up a lot of money right now. Our leans are growing. KN is not growing, but is producing a lot of stuff. So that's good. And uh, not very worried about that. We could probably look into expanding a little bit more eventually here. But I think we are expanding or we are growing so fast that we can just focus on the cities that we do have right now, first and foremost. And we should be able to reach these uh, 70... 70,000 people, 700,000 people that we need. See it continuously going up here as well. So, yeah, I'm really happy that you joined me today. I really did enjoy this episode. I hope you did as well. And of course, if you really did enjoy this, really, really, really did enjoy this, make sure that you are subscribed because I am the re releasing Railway Empire videos at least two times a week, most often three times a week. So, yeah. Please stay tuned, let me know in the comments what you think, and of course, hit that like button, it really helps me out. So, thank you very much for watching everyone, and until next time, bye bye.